Today we will discuss the answer for question number 34 which falls under General Studies paper 3. In GS3 I have taken the question from Science and Technology. As the cryptocurrencies topic, cryptocurrencies topic is coming frequently in the news and as you know cryptocurrency generally uses the blockchain technology the question is framed on the blockchain technology. The question is asking that blockchain technology is used not just in the cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin, but it has wide range of applications, particularly in the banking and finance sector discuss. So this is 10 marks question. So if you want to write more applications of the blockchain technology, let us say you know some 10 applications. About each application, you have to just mention one or two lines, but not more than that because you should try to finish the answer in one and a half pages to two pages. Let us see. Uh, I would suggest you that in the introduction, you write about what is blockchain technology elaborately. You write some, some five to six lines elaborately about the blockchain technology so that the evaluator will understand that first of all, you know about technology, only then you can talk about its applications. And conclusion, in this kind of conclusion, particularly any science and technology question, I would suggest you that in the conclusion you mention what India is doing regarding that, whether India has any plan, any strategy regarding using that particular science and technology application. So in the introduction, let us write about what is blockchain technology. See actually you can draw a diagram also, blockchain technology, blocks, actually blocks are pieces of digital information. They are digital information, particularly the transaction information will be saved in one block. Each block contains information about one transaction. The transaction time, date, who made the transaction, the parties involved in that, what has been purchased, all these things will be, means one transaction is completely uh, digitized in one block. And it will be cryptographically encrypted. It's encrypted data. Hence, it is safe. So we call each block as a hash. Hash is actually one kind of code used to cryptographically encrypt the data of a block. Now like that, several transactions are connected. So several blocks are connected in the form of a chain. That's why we call it as blockchain technology, blockchain. And see, after one transaction, let us say this is the first transaction, second one, third one, fourth one. So we call the position of that block as a height, height. For example, height 3, height 4. After this, the next, next transaction would be height 5, like that, like that. So you can draw like this, blockchain technology. And the entire blockchain, the entire blockchain is connected to several computers. For example, this is a blockchain. It is connected to several computers. And each computer is called as a node. Each computer is called as a node. And the entire blockchain is present in every computer. So in every computer, the entire blockchain copy is present. So the blockchain copy is not centralized in a, in a single place. It is decentralized across every computer that is connected to the blockchain. That's why we call it as decentralized. It is a kind of ledger, ledger with all the transactions clearly mentioned as per the height. So we call it as a distributed ledger. Now, why the manipulation and hacking is difficult? Because if it is centralized, if all of it there is a single place, the hacker can hack that particular system and he can manipulate it. But as the copies of these are distributed across several computers, the hacker has to manipulate several copies which is impossible. That's why hacking is difficult. Also, privacy is taken care of. The privacy is taken care of. Because the names of the transactors are saved in the form of username, the actual name is not there. Now, after you elaborate to explain the blockchain technology, we quickly come to explain the different applications. In the question, it is said that one of the applications is, just, is definitely Bitcoin. I mean, uh, one of the cryptocurrencies. In fact, blockchain technology has been invented 
for the Bitcoin only, for the Bitcoin cryptocurrency to maintain the ledger, blockchain has been invented. However, as it has several benefits, its application goes into wide range of sectors. Let us discuss some of those sectors. However, you have to focus specifically on the banking and finance. That's why you, you separately write the banking and finance applications here, separately. So friends, so here let us look at the applications of Bit, uh, the blockchain technology in each of the aspects. For example, Internet of Things. As you may be knowing that things can be connected electronically and internet connection can be given to all the things and they can be controlled together. So just like people to people interaction, things to things interaction is possible if all of them are connected to the internet. So in future, it is estimated that within next some 10 to 20 years, almost 100 billion things will be interact with each other. In such a case, security problems will definitely arise as hacking is possible. Hence, blockchain technology can be applied there. Similarly, microgrids. Actually, microgrid means solar microgrid, also called neighborhood microgrid, where every house can have their own solar panels and any excess energy can be sold, can be sent into the grid, it can be sold. For that, you can use the blockchain technology. How exactly it can be used? You no need to write because it's 10 marks question. Then blockchain healthcare. In healthcare, all the data of the patients and related doctors can be stored and privacy of the medical records of the patients can be you know, taken care of. Also, in case of surgery, automatically the data can be sent to the insurance companies so that insurance can be claimed. Similarly, blockchain music. Not only blockchain music, any trademark or any, you know, the uh, patents can be stored within the blockchain technology. For example, coming to the music, all the music names, the people involved can be saved in blockchain copies and hence their patent can be protected so that it cannot be used by somebody else. Also election. Recently in the USA in the elections, it has been said that the, some of the, you know, the votes have been manipulated. Hacking has been done to the election uh, reporting system. So, we do not know that it happened or not in USA or India also. However, in future, to save elections from this kind of hacking or manipulation, it is better to encrypt all the votes and use blockchain technology for elections. Also, identity problem. You may be knowing that when you give your phone number or name or email ID for purchasing certain thing, that company can actually pass on this data to somebody else who can start sending you ads. So this can be stopped by using the blockchain technology as the names and data can be encrypted. Now coming particularly to the banking and financial applications which has been asked in the question specifically. So smart contracts. For example, smart contract means in contract there will be several clauses. When clause 1 comes into picture, one kind of fraud has to happen. When clause 2 comes into picture, another kind of fraud has to happen. This can automatically be done by the uh, blockchain technology. Particularly in the insurance premiums, in the property law, in the crowdfunding sources, they are the common places where smart, smart contracts can be used. Now asset management. As you know that in asset management, several people are involved. The middleman, the banker, your manager and different, different uh, people involved in the property. So the data kept with each of the parties can be different. So they can be corrupted. Instead of that, to maintain the same data, same copy with everyone, blockchain technology can be used. Also insurance. Generally insurance frauds are common. Insurance can be claimed fraudulently by several companies. To in order to stop that, you can manage all the insurance data with the different parties in the blockchain technology. Also cross-border payment, remittances. You may be knowing that there are several corporates which function only on the remittances. So in the remittances, the cross-border payment, several parties are involved and the data has to be transferred from one to another without corruption, without getting manipulated. Hence blockchain technology can be used. Now coming to the particularly fraud detection. In banking sector what happens is all the data for example like ICIC bank, SBA bank or HDFC whatever, most of the data would be saved at a centralized level in a central system. And once it is hacked, the fraud can be easily done. Hence to reduce the fraud, you have to save the data in a decentralized way in several systems using blockchain technology. Similarly, anti-money laundering. Money laundering can be stopped, know your customer, the customer uh, data can be known by the banks by using the blockchain technology. Even trading platform as the, the stock exchanges use, you know, huge data, saved at several places and uh, uh, hacking can be done there. So, misusing most data is in centralized database. Now, blockchain technology makes it 
you know uh, decentralized because of which the trading platform cannot be corrupted cannot be manipulated thus we can say that the application of uh, blockchain technology is among us how do you conclude about india you can say that niti ayog niti ayog made a report of possible applications in india of the blockchain technology various sectors in india in which you can use blockchain technology and this has to be seriously taken consideration of in future for india to become technological change okay friends the question for tomorrow is gs paper 4 ethics in ethics syllabus specifically they mentioned about the attitude and aptitude hence we framed a question on this one it is the most common question the, the actual question in the exam may not be exactly the same but it would revolve around this so try to answer this question in 10 marks 150 words see you friends take care